In 2009, Austrian architect Splitterwerk invited the engineering firm Arup to join their design team in a competition for a smart material house which was to be built for the International Building Exhibition in Hamburg 2013. The design featured a second skin enclosing a stacked residential units to create a mesoclimate between inside and outside. A significant element of the concept was a facade applied microalgae system which was to generate both solar heat and biomass to supply the building with energy. Uh, the International Building Exhibition, EBA, in Hamburg presents the world's first algae-powered building. Uh, the algae used as a biomass for generating energy grown on the facade of the residential building. It consists of glass elements, uh, suffused with water in which uh, microalgae are bred for the purpose of generating energy for the light control and for providing shade for the building. The water with, with the algae are pumped uh, through uh, the whole system and uh, at the end uh, uh, we harvest it, harvest it with a filtering process and then uh, generate uh, there with chemical processes uh, energy. The facade also changes color with the continued growth of the algae and thus appears to be in motion. Uh, the zero carbon apartment complex will spot the bright green facade cum algae farm while its interior proposes a radical new theory on how we will live in the near future. The bioreactor not only produces biomass that can subsequently be harvested, but they also capture solar thermal heat. And both energy sources can be used to power the building. The photosynthesis is driving a dynamic response to the amount of solar shading required while the microalgae growing in the glass louvres provide a clean source of renewable energy. Aside from being able to produce biomass and hydrogen, they can also be used to detect pollution and absorb carbon dioxide while realizing oxygen. We have all heard about buildings powered by uh, solar or wind energy. But an algae powered building, nobody really um, heard about uh, this, uh, I think, five years ago. Um, at about the same size as bacteria, microalgae can produce more biofuel per hectare than alternative, alternative crops, uh, about 100 times more. So it's really, um, really a big challenge to uh, use algae for uh, energy. We think uh, architecture will fundamentally transform over the next five, uh, over, over the next uh, five, ten years, and of course also in a longer side, in, in, in 50 years, due to developments ranging from yet powered maintenance robots to high-rise farms and photovoltaic paint, all of which are already in development. But first and foremost, we envision a movement towards living buildings that respond and adapt the conditions around them. Uh, now the time has come that the Clever Tree Fork will be evaluated by our scientists and engineers for future research and adaption and for future building projects. But uh, the 2,600 square meter facility, the house, uh, 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 Clever Tree Frog is an experiment in residential architecture. It's now an experiment huh? and a demonstration of what tomorrow's facades can do and how we can probably will live in future.